There's been plenty of speculation about the prospect of turning the Airbus A380 into a private jet as the type winds down its commercial career. However, the practicality of such a move is in question. The CEO of Comlox Aviation, a leader in handling exclusive aircraft operations and management services to VIPs, explained to Simple Flying why the Super Jumbo wouldn't work as a business jet. At 2019's Dubai Airshow, Airbus Marketing Director David Velupalai shared that there is an eventual possibility of having a corporate jet based on the A380. He's highlighted the plane's popularity with passengers, along with its quietness and comfort, as reasons why it could be a good choice for the private sector. With these statements in mind, Simple Flying asked Comlux's leadership what they thought of this possibility. Founded back in 2003, Comlux has since been looking after VIP customers regarding the personal and professional management of their private aviation needs. With its sector position, the company would undoubtedly understand the requirements of the market. CEO Andrea Zanetto explains that there are too many limits that come with the deployment of the A380 as a private jet. While a big fan of the aircraft, he highlights the jet's restrictions and its impracticalities in business aviation. I think not even governments would go that way, and for private, you generally don't buy a castle if you want to have a luxury home. So why buy a castle? Maybe a few people in the world will have a castle, but in the end will not become cosy or nice to fly with. You cannot land anywhere, you just lean to main hubs. This is not an aircraft for private aviation. There are too many limitations on the aircraft, Zanetto told Simple Flying. Moreover, much like the reasons that commercial carriers have to stop deploying the aircraft, private jet operators have similar concerns regarding efficiency. In an environmental and financial sense, the giant quad jet is hard to justify in the current climate. Zanetto nonetheless affirms that even taking these factors out of the picture, the physical limitations are overwhelming. Regardless, if there ever is a request from a client to handle the Super Jumbo, his team would be keen to take it on. Maybe if a customer comes and asks us to operate, we would definitely be doing that, providing, as always, some limitations. Of course, in terms of aviation, it would be a fantastic, unique piece of art. I would like to see that, but as a consultant, I would not recommend it, unless you really have specific needs. Altogether, the Airbus A380 is rapidly disappearing from the skies, and it's becoming increasingly less common to spot units at airports across the globe. Several airlines were already going through retirement plans for the type before the global health crisis. However, the pandemic is significantly catalyzing the model's phase-out across the continents. Even though the likes of Emirates will likely continue to fly the plane throughout the decade, many of its current holders are expecting the plane to remain on the ground even after the industry recovers. As Zanetto suggests, it won't be a surprise to see a handful of individuals hit the skies with converted units of the A380. However, even if this happens, there will be considerable limitations. Thus, it would still be a rarity to spot the Super Jumbo in the decades to come. Can you see the A380 working as a private jet? Or do you agree with Comlux Aviation CEO and his opinion? Let us know in the comments. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles and a podcast every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe before you go.